Back in October, I made probably the worst financial decision I've ever made in my life. I bought a Trabant. I spent about two days fixing it and then drove it from Hungary all the way up to Berlin in Germany. Um, unfortunately, that didn't go as planned. Well, <laughs> this is eventful. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Fast forward a couple months, and thankfully I managed to make some friends in Germany. And they even offered to help me take the Trabant all the way back to Flensburg, which is where I was staying for Christmas and New Year's. Spent a couple months working on it up in Flensburg, getting it ready for its big voyage back to England. Me and my friends planned this trip quite a while ago, and originally uh, we planned on bringing Swedish cars, but obviously uh, Trabant is not Swedish. Obviously the Trabant is already here, my Volvo's here. But the last car, unfortunately, is in France, in Normandy more specifically. Right, hold on. Right, try. Go on. Okay, well, it does run. Hey! Right, you ready? Yeah, go on. That's reverse. Right. That's first. That's second. That's third. And that's fourth. Right, how well then? Let's fucking go. <laughs> oh, me. Holy fuck. <laughs> Literally oh, a chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> what? A fucking chainsaw. I can't remember how uh, full beam. Uh, <laughs> no full beam. Oh yeah, full beam. There we go. This is fourth gear. Fuck it, hell. Oh, the brakes are so bad. Wait, <laughs> boys, we're going 12,000 miles of this. <laughs> oh no, it's dying. It's dead. Oh fuck. Shit. It's, we've made it so far. Oh uh, yeah, dead. <laughs> Well, uh, I mean, we've got like fucking 150 yards. <laughs> oh well. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh. She runs. Just not teething issues, maybe. Yeah, just teething problems. Yeah, yeah. We made it run? down the road. <laughs> Well, looks like uh, me and Dan have done the correct thing and actually got our cars it's here. It's not even Swedish. It's not even fucking how, how Swedish, you mate. Right. It's a Trabant. Okay, well, Dan's, like, Dan's got his car. Dan has brought a Swedish car here. I've got the Trabant. So, uh, I guess the first challenge is we're going to have to go to Normandy. <laughs> yeah, it's a good place to go away, I guess. Right. I suppose there is. <laughs> uh, Amsterdam. 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 Oh, we go. We go. <laughs> we go. <laughs> This is the idle noise. So, yes, the engine sounds like you've just put like a lot of marbles in like a hamster ball and you're shaking it. That's what <laughs> it feels like as well. And then there's some tapping business going along. Yeah. Here. So I'm trying to get that to stop. That's how it is. It's still running somehow though, which is amazing. And then I'm pretty confident it will get back to England. <laughs> like just like the occasional spark change or whatever. Maybe. Yeah, it should be mint. <laughs> Sick. Breakdown number three, potentially time to change spark plugs again. We've got about a hundred mile out of these. Whoa! Put it in gear. If you know how. Well, we've uh, stopped the pizza. 
done 170 kilometers, about 100 miles. Right. Yes, please. Aye. No. Uh, yes, thank you. Okay. <laughs> uh, how, how's the Volvo? I've never missed a beat. Building. Well, it's shit. <laughs> but it's running. It is running. It's running. It's not here. <laughs> if it gets back to England, I'll be very happy. Aye. Broken. Fucking hell. <laughs> Jesus, man. <laughs> It's fixed! Ready. It's cool. It wouldn't fucking drive. We drive! <laughs> oh. <laughs> we go to the, uh, the VIP area? Yeah, yeah, we'll go to the VIP area. The van is on the move. Well, uh, we're off the ferry now, saying six hours drive to uh, our final destination for today. Hopefully we'll fucking get there. <laughs> yeah, Drabant's running well, just the uh, brakes are pretty shit. Yeah, the brakes yeah. are fucked. So fucked. Well, the uh, Trabant has proven ever more reliable. Just fucking broken down again, but it's running again. We just pulled the pipe off, put it back on. I think it's getting like an airlock or something, but we go. We're at the supermarket. Chabant's made it, Volvo's made it. How's the Volvo? Good. Getting some beers on. Yeah. That's yeah. the important thing right now. Are you enjoying the, uh, the heat? I am, yeah. yeah. You see, the thing is about the Volvo, uh, it, it has heat. It has heat. The Trabant does not. Yeah. And it has well, nice, what have I just had to do? Uh, put your thermal trousers on. Were, so you, were you nice about it? Uh, yeah, I think I was uh, not smug at all. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you think? I, I think he doesn't deserve his heat. <laughs> <laughs> I was also nice about your lack of radio and lack of headrest as well. Oh yeah, yeah. You said, oh yeah. At least, at least you've got a radio since you don't have heat. Oh wait. <laughs> Why have you got a fire on? Because uh, he's retarded. As you can see, we've got the third service of the day going on. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know if you can see this. It's a bit but, fucking uh, dark like. On, get, your, get your flashlight on this. Oh, there you go. Yeah, more spark plugs. Uh, How many of these have we went through today? Uh, quite a few. I think Four we're on our third pair now. Uh, the spark plug threads are all about fucked. So we're doing a bodge with some copper wire. Hopefully this is going to work and get us to the Netherlands. We're only two and a half hours to drive away. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Not surprised. Do you want to explain the plan, what you've just explained to me? So we're going to drive a one cylinder for 200 kilometers. Fucking ridiculous. Motorbikes only have one cylinder. This one, look. Yeah, but they have one cylinder. Have a better suggestion. They don't have any spare have cylinders. Have a better suggestion. No. Well, there we go. We've got to try. Yeah. Right. Some fuel coming out. <laughs> rock and roll, rock and roll, boys!
one cylinder. Yeah. Uh, how fast are we going? Like 60 kilometers an hour? 55, 60 kilometers an hour. That is top speed. The driver's went for two hours. It's going to be more like three and a half. Oh, this is awful. This is awful. I'm sorry to have to announce, but I can only assume by the lack of one cylinder Trabant behind me that Scott and Harry are dead. So I will have no other option than to continue on to Amsterdam alone in their absence. It's very unfortunate.